What's up guys? In this tutorial, I'll show you how to create a Moonton account and connect it to your Mobile Legends account. Creating a Moonton account is a great way to save your game progress and play on multiple devices. First, you need access to your profile in Mobile Legends. You can do this easily by tapping on your profile picture located at the upper left corner of the game's home screen. Once you're in your profile, look for the account option. Here, you'll see the option for a Moonton account with a prompt saying tap to connect. This is where you'll begin the process of creating your Moonton account. Tapping on tap to connect will prompt you to enter a valid email address. Make sure it's an email you have access to as you'll need to verify your account. After entering your email, you'll be asked to create a password for your Moonton account. It's important to create a strong password that meets the requirements listed. You'll need to enter this password twice for confirmation. Once you've entered your email address and password, hit Submit. After doing so, Moonton will send a verification code to the email address you provided. At this point, do not click on Check Email within the game, as this will take you to your browser and complicate the process. Instead, minimize or close the Mobile Legends app and go directly to your email app. For example, if you're using the mail app on your iPad, then open it. In your email inbox, you should see an email from Moonton. Open it, and there you'll find an Activate Now button. Click on this button to activate your Moonton account. This step is crucial as it verifies your email address and activates your account. After activating your account via email, it's a good idea to restart your Mobile Legends app to ensure the changes take effect. And that's it. You've successfully created a Moonton account and connected it to your Mobile Legends profile. This not only secures your game data, but also makes it easier to access your account across different devices. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.